Hello viewers, today we are going to learn how to give a dispersion effect in Photoshop of any version such like 2016 or 2015 or 2019. So let's begin our tutorial. First we select this one. So we are using for selection pen tool. This one is my favorite. So I'm going with pen tool and now start your selection. Zoom your image by pressing Ctrl plus and now start your selection when you complete your selection then just press ctrl and minus to zoom out the image now right click and go to make selection and make feather radiation 0 and press ok now your selection is complete now we are going to take a new document or new page so we are clicking on file then go to new and take a page the size is saved in my document so you can take this size 1920 height 1080 and make resolution 300 this is so important so then press ok this is your worksheet and now we are going to add our colorize our this blank page so we are going to adjustment layer and go to gradient and then take this one and choose as your wish now take the color okay press ok then go to radia and reverse and just remove this then click here take little bit darker and that one is perfect for my image now press ok this one is your background image and now take your model just drag and drop your model and remove these areas such like the background when the background shows areas remove this or just take pen tool zoom your image and easily remove this area take time because this one is so sensitive selection now next selection and press delete do same things in that area this one is done now take this one this area and this and this just simple select this one simply select this one and this just hold alt Control to remove the or carve the circle areas. Take time to make your selection. Now, again, make selection. Resolution zero. Press delete key. Remove now. And the last part is that one. You also remove this one or we are taking to remove this one for Lesotho because this one is so small and if you made a small mistake that's not notified and also remove this one
press delete then go to selection and deselect the selection control minus and adjust the size of your image so this one is perfect I'm not taking complete image I'm just taking this half image and then press ok then go to again quick selection tool and select your model and again please select your model then go to selection and mask click on refine edge mask tool and just rub this area simply rub this area take time and just simply rub this white areas and then see the magic just click on the containmented color and go to new layer then press ok it's automatically remove the white areas go to crop tool crop the line just ok cropping is completed now we are going to take remove this one delete and duplicate this image again and now go to filter and click on liquify okay then resize the brush and click this one and just stretch now your work is almost done now your work is almost done and just then just go to ok it's take little bit time as now this one is done and this look perfect now i am going to take a mask layer and go to paint bucket or paint bucket tool and black and just apply this it's removed now i am going to add a brush tool i'm going to take a brush and take this dispersion brush you can download this brush by Debian and I provide the link in description so you can download this one is directly from my link given link so now make foreground color white and then apply this brush opacity 100% Click on mask layer and then make foreground color white and then apply this brush. I already messed up. Click on this, go to paint bucket and make foreground color black and apply this. Then click on mask layer, go to brush tool, make foreground color white and apply the brush in this area. Here it is. Take time to make your dispersion effect this one is looks amazing when you complete the whole work now we are going to add little bit mask in this area so take a mask layer 
and make foreground color black and apply this. It's look pretty amazing that it's look like the boy is completely blowing air. Now we are going to do the same process with a girl. Make foreground color white and then apply the brush. Take time because this one is so the work of patience. So take time to make your work more better and looks amazing. Now again do the same process, click on mask layer, make foreground color black and apply brush in her body. So now it's look pretty cool. Go to mask and take a smart tool and hide the selection by using this mask a, a smart tool. This one is pretty awesome to hide the selection and very easy process to make your selection hide. It's almost done. Do the same thing with boy. Now your work is almost done or it's almost completed. Now we are going to add little bit dodge and burn tool. So we take this one, take a new layer, go to edit, go to click on fill and then go to 50% gray. Clipping marks and go to overlay. Then go to dodge tool and oh sorry this one is so white so we are going with burn tool then make little bit darker do the same thing with the upper layer go to fill 50 percent gray clipping mask and overlay Now it's look almost good and great. So we are going to finish our work. So what you have to do, we mask this complete layer in one layer. Just hold Shift Alt Control plus E, then duplicate this one and go to filter, camera raw filter. and make clarity little bit higher or 
shadow area little bit minus increase the saturation little bit click on effects and then just minus 8 percent increase the sharpness and decrease the vibrant highlighted area make red is perfect or make this one is yellow and darker area it's not it's almost completed then press ok now give a final touch so go to filter and take new collection and go to color effects pro 4 then press ok now this one is completed if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel see you soon with new tutorial okay goodbye and thank you for watching